This is him with Kaylee when she was 18. Hooked up with the 18-year-old. He said he wants to buy a house and have them all get together. And he's been knowing her since she was 15. Exhibit C. C. So Drake and Georgia Smith were first linked in early 2017 after she performed on his tour and was later featured on More Life. She was 19 and Drake was 30 at the time. It's rumored that, that he made the song jaded about her. You have potential. I could have shaped it. You went and caved in. We could have waited. I wasn't rushing. Difference in ages. You're old enough, but you're still a baby. It oh my God. Yo, this nigga, man. Are you kidding me? This nigga writing songs about this shit? What the f- that that he made the song jaded about her you have potential i could have shaped it you went and caved in we could have waited i wasn't rushing difference in ages you're old enough but you're still a baby what the f man listen listen bro it, it, man this dude man look i won't be surprised if they come out with a documentary on this nigga i'm i ain't even playing this nigga better do everything they ask him to do the moment he tell them no, that's your ass, Mr. Postman. I'm telling you right now, the day to Drake, don't go to them parties. <laughs> the day to Drake, tell them no. And who are they? Y'all know who they are. The day Drake says no to those people, and that's your ass, Mr. Postman, because you got a history, buddy. You boy, boy, you boy, you boy, you boy, you treading on thin ice. You always like that 17, 18, 19 age. Boy, but boy, you treading on thin, very thin ice. You better go to all them parties, boy. You better do what they tell you to do. Because if they don't, shh, that's your ass, Mr. Postman. All right? Because this ain't looking good, boy. You got a weird fetish for these young girls. Allegedly. Exhibit C, Drake and 13-year-old Millie Bobby first met at his concert in Australia in 2017. Drake, he wants to see me. And I was like, okay, we're going. So I like, go out. And he was such a fanboy. And I was such a fangirl. That we, and honestly, we text all the time now. He helps me with everything. Like, he's a man. Why are you texting these? 30 times speaks tipped $5. I can't fathom being into young girls like this. When grown women are like autistic weirdo types. Drew Loversick. Bro, I, face. I, I'm not interested. I, like, I, I don't, man. Listen, I don't. I don't care if it's legal. Or whatever the case may be, bro. Calvin Barner super shattered two dollars. Sounds like grooming to meet Edwin's fatality. Hey, and and he always seems to know them young, and then he waits until they get legal, and then he might shoot a shot. Appreciate you, Kevin. Calvin with the two. Appreciate you. Oh, speaks with the five. Listen to this little white girl. Oh, I've been knowing him about about fifteen, and we just text, and we just have so much fun, and and we. I don't want to text no fifteen year old. What the fuck we gonna talk about? What me as a I don't know how old he was, maybe 20 something, 25. 20, what do I have? Why do I need to be texting a 15 year old girl? No, nah, I'm not interested. I'm not playing those games, man. What's wrong with this nigga, man? Drake, boy, you better go to all them parties. I'm telling you, Drake, boy, you better not tell them people no, because all this shit going to come back, boy. And you mess with these little white girls. Now, Drake, I know you have white, but trust me, in the court of law, you're going to be all the way black. I'll tell you that right now. <laughs> Right when you tell them no, oh nigga, you gonna be the most thuggish, ruggish bone out there. You might be half black today, but 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 shit, tell them no, you you gonna be all the way black. And honestly, we text all the time now. He helps me with everything, like just life lessons. Um, he's amazing. He's a Thirteen-year-old Millie Bobby first met at his concert in Australia in 2017. Drake, he wants to see me, and I was like, "Okay, we're going." So I like go my and and he was such a fanboy, and I was such a fangirl that we, and honestly, we text I'm saying me personally, Ralph, that this is weird behavior. Me as a grown person, I wouldn't be, I wouldn't even put myself in a situation, especially if you got all this money. Y'all haven't, uh, y'all haven't heard me accuse Drake of nothing. I said, this just don't look right, bro. This don't look right. And I'm telling you, Drake, and I'm sure you know this too. Boy, you better not slip up. Because <laughs> they're going to be, boy, they're going to have a lot of shit on you, boy. All right. It just don't look right. It don't look right. I met him in Australia, and um, he's honestly so fantastic, and a great friend, and a great, uh, great role model. You know, we texted, we just texted each other the other day, and he's like, I miss you so much. I'm like, I miss you more. He's coming to Atlanta, so I'm definitely. I miss you. I'm gonna see him. I'm so excited. Yeah. You and Drake. That's awesome. That's awesome. What advice does he give you? Like, what does he say? Uh, about boys, he helps me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's great. He's wonderful. I love him. Very simple. You know, that's easy. The text message. <laughs> 
to post this picture. She was kindness. Oh, look who took the photo. The person who's going on dinner dates with her frequently and hanging out with the, her a lot. Drake. Two months later, during a Golden Globes after party, Drake and Millie posed for photos. Millie Cap. Oh, that's her. Oh, that's the same. Oh, that's the same girl that I was. Oh, that I said the other time. She opposed with Drake. Blessed to have my security be my plus one at the Netflix party. This is them at the party together. According to reports, Drake 31 and Millie 13 spent the entire night together at the party. Okay. An eyewitness spotted the Canadian rapper and the British actress hanging out and said the duo were inseparable all night and that they were clearly buddies. Despite the odd pairing, the insider told E! News that the two had a lengthy, in-depth conversation by themselves and many times throughout the night it was just the two of them talking in, in a corner. At the Sag Awards the same month, Millie was asked about her new friendship with Drake. In the interview, she says, Drake is my man and shares how excited it was to meet him. Drake also wishes her a happy 14th birthday. Drake is my man. I love Drake. He is amazing. So this is her. In, in quote, this is what she says. Drake's my man. I love Drake. He's amazing. Drake then posted on his story. Happy birthday, Mills. Big love for L. Millie posted a photo wearing Scorpion merch that Drake sent her a few months later. So the caption says, thank you, Champagne Poppy, for the sick jacket. Tour starts in June. I'm so excited to catch a show. Love you. With man, listen, I, I would... I, I... I wouldn't even, man. It's just, it, it don't look right, man. From the outside looking in, just looks, it, they might have the most friendliest relationship, but man, this just, this just don't look right. And I can say it don't look right. That's my motherfucking opinion. I don't give a fuck who don't like it. This just don't look right. I ain't saying that he doing anything. Y'all haven't heard me say that he is sexually active with any of these people. It just don't look right. All right. It just, I, I it, this just don't look right, man. So th maybe this is why he's, you know, Kendrick is saying all these things. It's just, a lot of coincidences, huh? Scorpion merch on. So Drake is obviously inviting her to a show because they're good, good friends. When she's 13. In 2018, The Guardian put out an article where it detailed how Charlotte something became an Instagram sensation. Her mother explained in the article a story about Drake, 31 at the time, FaceTime and Charlotte and Madison Beer, who were both 18. How does he know all these young girls? So it's 113 after another, 118. One, why does he? Why? Uh, another one? Now she 18? <laughs> What's up, Trina? They were in the back of the car chatting away and checking in on social to say they were in Toronto, just like normal teenagers. And then suddenly Madison was like, oh God, it's Drake FaceTime that should I answer? I thought, okay, she's hanging out with Drake. I guess this is for real. This is what mom said in the interview. Next, 18-year-old Bella Harris shares a photo with 31-year-old Drake when she was backstage at his concert. In the caption, she put, no place I'd rather be. And this is her. Her and Drake hugged up. Okay. Drake reportedly shut down a restaurant for a private dinner with her. He met her in 2016 when she was 16 years old. Is there a coincidence that he always playing around with this shit? He he seems to be very romantic. Like like I can see. If you're giving a fan just a thank you for supporting me hug, this don't look like thank you for supporting me hug. This look like, you know what I'm saying? Yo, what's wrong with this? Bro, these, oh, these are young, man, what's wrong with this nigga, man? Bro, th th this just don't look right, man. This shit just, this shit is wild, man. This is her and Drake hugged up, okay? Drake reportedly shut down a restaurant for a private dinner with her. He met her in 2016 when she was 16 years old. This is her in May of 2016. The caption says, too good with a heart. This a 16 year old girl posed with this grown ass man. And he starts to get a bit more touchy and take public pictures with her when she is a little older. It's two years later. She also wished Drake a happy 30th birthday and he commented on the post when she was 16. This is her in 2016 saying, Happy birthday, old man. At Champagne Pop, cheers to more life. She has an Obi. This nigga over here got heart. Man, come on, man. Y'all can't say this ain't, man. Come on, bruh. Calm, bro. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't even pay attention to, to all this shit. I swear, to, I didn't even pay attention to all this. All this stuff started coming out now. All this shit started, man. I don't care what y'all say, man. This this is a pattern. This is a pattern, man. This ain't this. Is something 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 ain't right, bro. Something ain't right. Like I said, I ain't saying that he doing anything. I'm just saying this don't look good. We don't look good. We, we can all voice our opinion. In my motherfucking opinion, in this beautiful country of mine, I say that this shit don't look good. This shit don't look good. Merch. Their champagne poppy in the comments with the heart eye emoji. Leaving this comment under a 16 year old's picture. Next, we have an artist named Sydney Christine. Another one! Uh, salute to Calvin. I need Calvin you to say that I wasn't. $2. Yo, Batman, I need you to say that wasn't lying. Hey, I, I don't know nothing about nothing. Look, all I'm saying is this shit don't look right. Shit. Shit. I ain't gonna know until we get black and white. And I ain't talking about this black and white picture right now, even though this is black and white. Now, we're gonna see what this black and white looking like. But uh, I ain't saying a goddamn thing. I'm just saying it, it don't look right. That's all I'm going to say. It don't look right. Me personally, I wouldn't be 
you know, going to 18, 18, 16, 16, 15, 15, 14, 14, 13, 13, 13 15, 16, 18. Hey, congratulations. Yeah, conversation. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Me personally, I wouldn't entertain that. No, 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 no. She reveals some very interesting information. At the time of this interview, she's 22 years old. First person, and really the only artist I reached out to was Drake. I uh, never met him, like, never spoke to him. I don't know why he's been following me for the past, like, six years. I don't know why. Like, <laughs> yeah, I never spoke to him, but like, we didn't reach out, like, send him the beats. And then he was swore, he was like, all right, don't, tell me something, nothing happened. But he had been following her for six years, since she was 16 years old. She even said it herself. Drake been following her since six, man, bro, what the <laughs> fuck? You gotta be kidding me. She even said it herself. He has this very interesting selection. 16, 17, 18. He seems to be treading that line a lot. Mm. The Drake thing. Mm -hmm. You met him when you first met him. So, so I played basketball, right? So he right. really was a fan of one of our, not fans, supporting one of my teammates um, at the time. He seems to be supporting a lot of young women. I'm at the beach. So this is another one. This is another one. In yeah, in high school. So he was a fan of women's basketball, high school basketball. I was her teammate, so he followed me because of her. And I was like, oh shit, bitch, you got Drake to follow me? I was like, that's so crazy. So oh, he followed me, and I just, I lost it. I'm like, I have to be Drake. Like, I love Drake. I've always so Drake is a fan of women's high school basketball. He keeps up with the. Drake, you're a fan of women high school basketball. Why? They're not even that good. If you say the WNBA, I could halfway believe you. High school? High school basketball, bro? You're a fan of women high school. I, I, I can halfway, but 60% believe you if you say the WNBA because they're more developed and skilled. But high school, bro? High school? Why not college? I mean, that's still, I mean, but damn, high school, bro? High school. Let me guess. Now you're gonna say, "Oh, I love middle school soccer girl team. Oh, I, I love I, I love uh, high school volleyball. You know, I just I'm, I'm just here just to support. I want to I want to support all the black women. You know, there's there's not a big support for uh, 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 girls high school volleyball teams. So your next sport is gonna be high school volleyball teams, huh? Not even college, but high school, huh? Okay. All right. Cool. 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 All right. All I know is you better not say no. <laughs> you better go to all them parties, boy. <laughs> you better go to all them parties. Woo you, better, you better go to all them parties, all right? The players, and he follows them on Instagram. <laughs> Next up, we have Kylie Jenner. Okay, reportedly they were briefly dating when she was 22 and he was 33. I'm not like, uh, who cares? She was a bitch. Six years earlier, Drake performed at Kylie's 16th birthday party when he was 27. Kylie shares a photo of Drake kissing her on the cheek. This is him kissing her at her 16th birthday party. Calm, yo, this nigga. Another angle. This nigga's a wild boy, boy. She had just turned 16. <laughs> Uh, Drake, who was 28 at the time, posted a photo with Kylie, who was 17 on Instagram during his beef with Tiger. He he's a man. I could keep going on and on. It seems like Drake just has a, uh, a interesting age selection. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Moving on. Y'all leave a comment down below, man. Shout out, shout out to this young lady. Hey, I'm going to hit your like button. Amazing video. I definitely, I didn't know about this pattern that Drake has. I really didn't know all of this. This shit is just, hey, boy, you better go to all them porters. <laughs> you better not tell them no. Because um, you seem to have a lot of young people contact. And you seem to be following them. I, me, personally, y'all can't find out. If, if it's not my niece, if it's not my niece, if it's not somebody, I'm not following no 16-year-old girl, high school girl, say, oh, I'm a fan of you. Nah, man, what the fuck? <laughs> man, no, nah, I'm not even scrolling down Instagram. How do you even find them? How do you even, bro, I don't even scroll down high school. How do you even find these little girls? How, how do you follow them? Where, where do you go look? Like, I don't, bro, if you go, if you scroll through my phone, you're going to see grown ass adults. So, you know, on your, on your, on your, on your timeline, your timeline shows you things that you like. If you go to my timeline, you're going to see grown ass women. You're going to see sports. You're going to see food reviews. Cause that's all I watch. I like grown ass women. <laughs> I watch basketball clips. And food reviews. That's all you see on my timeline because that's the the algorithm is going to dish out to your account the stuff that you like. So I, I wonder what Drake timeline looks like. Maybe that's how he finds all these uh you know high school players. I, I, I wonder what his timeline looks like. Hmm. Moving on. Moving on.